story the blue jackal once a jackal was roaming about in search of food it was an unlucky day for him he could not get anything to eat tired and hungry he walked on and on for a long time at last he found himself in the streets of a city he knew that it was not safe for a jackal to walk about in a city but he was so hungry that he had to take the risk i must find food he said to himself but i hope i won't meet any danger from men or dogs suddenly he heard the danger signal the dogs were barking he he knew that they would soon be after him he was frightened and began to run but the dogs saw him and they ran after him the jackal ran faster and faster to get away from the dogs but the dogs were just behind him suddenly the jackal ran into a house the house belonged to a dyer in the yard there was a large tub filled with blue dye as the jackal ran he fell into the tub the dogs could not find the jackal so they went away the jackal stayed in the tub until he was sure that the dogs had gone away then slowly he crawled out of a tub he was surprised to find that he had now become blue all over he did not know what to do he must get back to the jungle without being seen by men or dogs he quickly returned to the jungle all the animals who saw him ran away in fear they had never seen an animal of this color the jackal saw that they were afraid of him he was quick to think of a plan to make use of this why do you run away he cried come come back to me hear what i have to say the animals stopped running they stood at a distance and looked at him they were still afraid to go near him come all of you cried the jackal again call all your friends to i have something important to tell you one by one the animals went to the blue jackal you need not fear me said the blue jackal you are safe with me god has sent me to be your king i offer you all king's protection the animals believed what he said they bowed low before him your majesty they said we take you as our king we thank god for sending you to us please tell us what you want us to do you are to look after your king well said the blue jackal you are to provide him with all the good food a king needs certainly your majesty the animals said we shall do everything for our king's comfort what else can we do for you you must always be loyal to your king the blue jackal replied then the king will protect you from your enemies the animals were satisfied they gave all delicious food to jackal and looked after him well the jackal lived like a king every day the animals paid their respects to him and told of their problems the king listened to them and told them what to do One day as the king sat in the court a noise was heard in the distance it was the howling of a pack of jackals the blue jackal had not heard the voice of his people for a long time he was lonely now he felt happy his eyes filled with tears of joy forgetting that he was now a king the jackal lifted up his head and howled immediately all the animals knew who he was he was only a cheap jackal he had cheated them all the animals were so angry that they rushed at him to tear him to pieces but the jackal was already on the run he ran and ran faster and faster and was thus able to save his life